You know the worst thing about being a skateboarder in Texas? It's so dang hot outside. I go to the skate park to go warm up, and I'm already warm by the time I walk to the skate park. One good thing about it being that hot outside is that everyone just really doesn't like skating in the heat, so no one goes to the skate park until later in the day. So you have the entire skate park to yourself, which I love doing that because I am an introvert and I hate interacting with people. And there's probably something wrong with me because of that, but I don't care. So if you're in Texas and you're trying to skateboard and it's 100 degrees outside, here's a few things that you probably want to get before you uh, before you go out and skate in the in the heat. Number one is more than just one water bottle. Most people will bring a water bottle. It's not enough. Not even close. I drink my water bottle before I even get to the skate park. So bring more than one water bottle or one really, really big water bottle. And number two, there's these things that are like uh, rags, but they're meant to be, uh, to wrap around your neck and they like hold, hold the water and keep you cool. And it stays like that for a little while. And then, you know, all your extra water that you're bringing, you, if it, you know, dries up, you just pour a little bit more on there. Um, I forget what they're called. Okay, they have a bunch of different names. Um, one on Amazon for $15 is called a Cool Rag Extreme. So, you know, you for you put water in it and it keeps you cool because you wrap it around your neck. Um, there's also a cooling hoodie you could get that you put over your head. You know, look like an assassin from Assassin's Creed and keep yourself cool at the same time, kind of. Um, those are like 20 bucks. Number three is you probably, if you're bringing multiple water bottles, are probably not like, you know, ones that will keep your water cool or anything. You want to bring a cooler and you can put snacks in that cooler. If you're like planning a whole day at the skate park and you're going to be there for more than, you know, like an hour or two, you you want like, you could bring a cooler, you know, put ice in it, obviously, and then put your water. Um, maybe if you like other drinks like Gatorade or like Snapples or Arizona's or something like that, put those in there. And then, you know, you put some snacks that need to be, you know, that are okay if they're a little cold which is preferred when it's really hot outside. You put those in there with it and then you can you can live out the rest of however long you're gonna be at the skate park and not be having heat exhaustion. All right, those are my couple tips for skateboarding in summer and Texas because it's super, super, super hot outside. And um, enjoy the edit that I got at the skate park while it was super, super hot outside.